I was literally I had stopped signing films because nothing was interesting me and when this came along I was like I have to be this character I felt like that 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 feeling came after so long uh that I grabbed it with both my hands you know and and once you're so interested in doing something you will do anything it takes I'm not very judgmental as a person mm. uh that helps me in and also like when you tell stories um in which you have characters who are doing you know very questionable acts what happens is it leaves the door open uh, yeah. it it lets people into the world it lets people a person see that person in a new light it's not usual that in our lives in our normal common lives we would go and interact with a prisoner hello my name is gulshan devaya and this is sonakshi sinha i'm reema kakti i am vijay verma and you're watching us on peeping moon dot com <laughs> dot com hello everyone welcome to peeping moon dot com i am rashita sahani and today joining me for a super interesting conversation is gulchand devaiya sonakshi sinha reema kakti and vijay verma who are all set to keep all of us at the edge of our seats with the heart hi you guys how have you been Good. fantastic Very fantastic i was uh, at the trailer launch and i could feel that you know this series is going to be really intriguing and as i mentioned an edge of the seat watch which i think we have all been craving for for a really long time uh, but reema starting with you you know making something that's based on crime it has drama it's sort of a thriller as well a uh, combining this genres must have been a tough task also getting the casting right now that i have seen all of these wonderful actors play it i cannot imagine anyone else in their place so you know getting these two things right how was it uh well i mean the writing is always a challenge and then uh, lo- you know with long format because of the volume of writing hmm. the challenge becomes that much more but uh, again we had a wonderful set of uh, writers there was ritesha who was the lead writer there was uh, a bunch of young kids there was uh, chetanya there was karan shah there was mansi jain there was uh, sunaina kumari and myself who k- kind of uh, negotiated i think about we were writing for almost a year and a half two years wow. over uh, many many drafts and uh, the casting of it i think was way smoother okay because uh, literally like you know all of these people were our dream cast and we went to them and they said yes so <laughs> wow but uh, so nakshi as i mentioned now i can't imagine anyone else also because we have had very less female actors play the role of a cop and each time someone plays it i remember watching uh, tabu in kutte and thinking oh my god we need more badass savage <laughs> uh, women coming out there and playing the these strong parts and in the trailer uh, you were called lady singham so many people will uh, call, uh, te- com- you know draw comparisons to chulbul pandey also because it was your first film uh, how do you firstly manage to tackle that also secondly the pride of getting these strong parts finally <laughs> I think there's nothing to tackle really. Uh people will can say what they want based on what they've seen. Uh that's fine. That's completely their call and their opinion. Uh once they see the show they understand themselves how different it is from uh Achulbul Pandey or any other cop character that we've seen uh on screen. I think it's very uh, what Reema and Zoya try to done is like keep it very real, very raw um and that's how I've played it. So yes it's a very strong role it's a very powerful character uh she's she's a strong bold woman she gets what she wants and she just doesn't leave any stone under, unturned until uh, you know that's happened so it's for me it was a dream character yeah and, and she doesn't sweat yeah and she doesn't sweat <laughs> and <laughs> she also has her prep to perfection because uh i remember reema uh, you know revealing that you were better than the stunt double <laughs> and uh, you were called <coughs> that aap hi kar lo aake so you know getting that prep also and getting into the skin of the role H- how do you manage to do that with so much conviction i was actually just waiting to get a role like this i i was literally i had stopped signing films because nothing was interesting me and when this came along i was like i have to be this character i felt like that 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 feeling came after so long uh that i grabbed it with both my hands you know and and once you're so interested in doing something you will do anything it takes um so whether it was riding a bike these are all things that i kind of picked up very fast because i was always wanting to uh you know so it it just happened really organically and very uh, smoothly 
for me. We we all of us did our diction classes. We did workshops uh, to get the dialect of uh, you know what you see us speaking uh, correct. Uh, and it was super fun. And for me, it's always so fun to learn something new yeah. because you just stop learning otherwise. Like uh, the reason why I love my job so much is that every day you're learning something. And when it's for a project like this, yeah. and you get to learn a new skill um, and do something different, it's very very exciting. Fantastic! Yeah. Looking forward to watching you. Thank you, uh, Gulshan. Whenever you pick something up, there is this quirk in it. Automatically, it enters, and I really enjoying watching you. Thank like you. Uh, when I watched Badhai, though, I was feeling the same thing. That wow, this character is so good, and uh, you know everything that you do. I am uh, like I'm a fan of your work that you've been doing. Thank you. Here, so much. here, what's that quirkiness or what's that uniqueness that you're getting along with your character? There's no quirkiness in season one. Hopefully, in season two, they'll give me a sequence where, at a wedding, I get drunk and I dance. <laughs> He shared the video of the kind of dance. I've given them references also. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Have you seen that? Seen that? <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, for it. all the fans the of my note, quirky uh, roles, uh, there's this is not really a one that I would classify as a quirky okay. role. Okay. He's a nice guy. He's just a good guy. Yeah. Don't you like good guys? No, you know no, <laughs> girls like no. bad boys. <laughs> mm. No, but like good guys also. Give good guys a chance. You're talking to the wrong guy then. Yeah. yeah. Please shift focus. No, but a little about your character. Um, he's uh, the SHO of uh, and uh, technically the boss of uh, Sonakshi and mm. Soham's character, and. Uh, he wants to do the right thing. He he understands that there are some things in the system that are corrupt, mm. and they have their way of functioning. Uh, but he tries to find a way sometimes around that and uh, do the right thing. He's not able to do the right thing every time, but his intention is always to do the right thing. Just like you finding the right roles in Bollywood. I try, and so <laughs> does uh, Devi Lal, and we don't get it right sometimes. Okay. बट विजय आपका कैरेक्टर हर एक्टर की ऐसे दिल्ली तमन्ना होती है कि मिले ऐसा कुछ करने को एंड यू ऑल कैन लाफ इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बटिंग आई गो बैक टू डार्लिंग्स और एनी अदर रोल ऑफ योर्स यू नो देर इज अ सर्टन ग्रेन एज दर आई सी बट आई डू समाइम्स ऑल्सो फील बैड फॉर योर कैरेक्टर लाइक इवन एंड डार्लिंग्स दैट हैपन टू मी also because even though you sort of sometimes play gray roles you leave that human nature in that character and then we we are sort of like who are we to judge how do you balance it and also is it a conscious choice to play out of the box roles i i don't see uh, people in black and white yeah i i feel like every all of us have potential of being extremely bad and extreme goodness Agreed. it all lies among us and i'm not very judgmental as a person mm. uh that helps me in and also like when you tell stories um in which you have characters who are doing you know very questionable acts what happens is it leaves the door open uh, yeah. it it lets people into the world it lets people a person see that person in a new light it's not usual that in our lives in our normal common lives we would go and interact with a prisoner or a police person will get to know their life or a psychopath Sorry. or for that matter somebody who's dealing with alcohol oh, so i i try to understand these hmm. people when i get to do these parts and when i understand it i try to portray it as honestly and as much as i have understood so in 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 hoping that you know we will expose part of uh, these personalities to people for them to also have a vision of what they've not seen in their lives um so that is that is I, uh, that is the larger purpose of the work that I am doing. I feel, uh, and has it been a conscious choice? Yes, I feel like uh, there aren't too many. Uh, uh, I mean, I, I may be wrong, but there aren't too many male actors who are willing to take difficult roles. You are absolutely right. So I, I see that there is a great potential there, and yeah. for somebody like me who wants to constantly keep pushing myself, I feel like it's a great fertile ground. also because i don't think you take too much pressure about the tag of being the hero those <laughs> actors maybe they yeah, deny such roles but that's on, on screen but i also don't take huh. the tag of being a role model or a okay. hero or a leader huh. i don't want to be any of this i just want to be an actor just plain simple actor who is that service for the director yeah fantastic 
Uh, Rima, do you feel that with these, uh, the series, uh, with Dahar, a lot of people will get motivated, a lot of young women will get motivated to join the police force. We had a brief conversation about this at the launch. Uh, is that your motive somewhere in your head? Uh, I hope it motivates women in general. You know, not just to, I mean, obviously, when, you know, uh, if, you know, uh, you were there at the launch and it was uh, you know, just meeting Dr. Miran and Correct. talking to her, I mean, it was, you know, I, I think that, yes, I would like to encourage women to join the police force, mm -hmm. but generally, I just hope it encourages women and men. It's not, uh, I mean, this isn't a man-woman thing. Mm -hmm. You will see when you watch the show, mm -hmm. you know that uh, things are not that black and white. But do I, I mean, so in that sense, yeah, I hope it generally inspires everybody. Yeah. I hope so too. Uh, lastly, Sonakshi, do you feel uh, a lot of people after watching you in The Heart will take the actor in you a little more seriously? Because I have just watched the oh, trailer. Oh, they better. <laughs> <laughs> but I am already very confident. I started the first episode also that uh, this is going to, uh, you yeah. know, be the... It mm -hmm. act of uh, yours. Also selecting uh, quality projects than quantity. That has been, I think, your motto for a long time. Uh, yeah. Um, and I reached that point by doing the quantity uh, projects, you know, and, and no regrets. I'm very unapologetic about all the work that I've done because I did it in my complete awareness. Um, I'm I'm a smart girl. I, whatever I've learned, I've learned while on the job, even though I come from, I am an <coughs> actor's daughter. Uh, but that's not where I got any of my um, knowledge about films, about acting, about anything. Whatever I learned, I've learned on the job. So I'm very proud of all my decisions, actually, even the bad ones. Because I like to learn from my mistakes and I like to make them on my own. And um, I, I think I've learned quite a bit over the last uh, 12, 13 years that I've been working. And now I've come to a place where I know exactly in my mind what it is that I want to do. And this was um, really a role that I was waiting for. And I'm glad it came to me at this point of time in my career. And I'm very, very excited about it. So yes, I hope when the audiences watch me, um, they do see a very different side of me than they've seen before. Than Amazing. They've seen before. But I think they will, because for mm -hmm. me as a director, I mean, just waking up and going to set every morning and having you know them and Soham yeah. who's not here with yeah. us is really inspiring yeah. it's just really really inspiring yeah. to go to set and work with these people every day oh, oh Soham God. we miss you yeah. <laughs> <laughs> also because all of the, <clears throat> them including Soham they have this uh, you know acting skill attached with their names like we always appreciate their acting style so definitely it's like a dream star cast to watch uh, and uh, I'm personally and work waiting. With. Yeah, work with, of course you have. Uh, personally waiting to watch The Heart and all the very best for the show. Thank you, thank so, you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So thank much. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.